Hey, welcome to my channel or welcome back loyal viewers. I'm Kerry, the nosy housefrau, and today I have something a little bit different. I'm sticking my nose in on a photo that is Jeffree Star and his rose quartz. Now you'd think, why would you make a video this long about this? But what happened was I had no intention of making any video. I've been in a real funk and I'll go into why at a later date, but this was a rough week for me. And I was in my room feeling sad and my son came in and, and saw me on Twitter and that picture was on the screen. And he started saying stuff that was so funny that I said, do you mind if I hit record? No pressure. I mean, if you don't want me to upload it, I won't, but I want my viewers to be privy to this conversation because you're so funny. And it, I swear I got the laugh that I've really needed for a long time. Um, I'm sorry that at times in this video you might not be able, to, I might not even be audible because I'm laughing so hard. But I thought I'd like to share that with you because um, it was a much needed moment of levity in my life and it has made me feel so much better. So how can I be anything but appreciative of this photo at this point? So without further ado, here is a conversation that you can listen to between me and my son, Zach, the funniest person on the planet. Okay, there's so much to say about this picture. <laughs> my son came in and we're having a conversation and I'm going to make you guys privy to this conversation because it's just too good. First, a huge big thank you to Jeffree Star for breaking my blue mood with his <laughs> yet another gem. I don't know if you've noticed on social media, but Jeffree's thing now is gems. He is <laughs> raping and pillaging the earth Wait, for he has gems. more like this? He's got, he recently, okay, let me back up. He recently had a big amethyst that he he took a picture of by the now famous couch that freaks people out. Very controversial. The most controversial couch in the history of sofas and furniture in general. Um, okay, this thing that my son thought looked like a trash bag. I genuinely, first time I saw, I glanced at this photo, I genuinely thought that was just a trash bag. <laughs> okay, but backing up, he had a massive amethyst and had to point out, because this is important, this is the biggest amethyst harvested this year. <laughs> like, he needed the biggest one. Like, I... I don't understand this because, okay, first of all, um, the fact that it has to be the biggest, that wasn't on my mind when I saw it, you know, I was like, I don't know what, where he's saying, like, he just one day was like, I bring me all of the gems, I'm not going to put, and in this picture, he's clearly, he's sitting in a zen garden, so we know he doesn't have cats, because you couldn't have that if you had cats, and looking like... It's a trash bag. The Zen guard. There's so much to this photo. Like, at first, okay, at first I thought it was a trash bag, and then I noticed it was a huge rock, and then I noticed the gigantic face on the back of the, on the um, wall. I think and you can I guess noticed... that that's the biggest face Harvest did this year. <laughs> <laughs> he's got the biggest wall face it, out of all the wall faces. And he's sitting in a Zen guard. He's sitting in, he's sitting in sand. This is such a weird photo. But why is it like, meet my new rose quartz? Like, yeah. I guess he didn't want to get tigers. So now he's got, <laughs> he's got so much money, he's got to get gems. I guarantee you, he probably thinks they're giving him powers or something like that. Yeah. They're like, I need an extra huge rose quartz. I don't know if this is a sign that he's really into gems or he has switched up the weed he's smoking <laughs> and now thinks he needs power from the earth. He got the wrong message from Infinity War and now... <laughs> For all of the gems. <laughs> and that's not his best hair. I mean, listen, yeah, listen, I've, I've got some crap wigs, I know. And, but I've, they're cost 200 bucks at least. They're not that bad. This thing, if you bought your house like $20 million cash, you can get some really good human hair. You can that's afford all I'm some saying. good wigs. You can afford some wigs that don't look like Uma Thurman from Pulp Fiction. I know. you got to save your gem. <laughs> Amelie. Um, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you, 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 listen, we're not wig shame and I cannot wig shame, but I'm just saying that's not his best look. It, I have a right to make fun of this. In my opinion, this is like, yes, I am, I am gem shaming here because you made yourself a Zen garden and I'm assuming he's at home. Um, unless he has a friend with the same hobby. What is, I don't know what this new kick is. But. I mean, I, I have much more tasteful uh, rocks in my indoor <laughs> zen garden. Can you imagine? <laughs> can you imagine going to his garage sale? <laughs> you would need to bring a crane. <laughs> just like, just to uh, the... All right. Uh, how much do you want for the huge, gigantic face? <laughs> I'll give, you, I'll give you 20 bucks if you throw in the huge was... trash bag shaped rock. <laughs> that, that was, um, how much do you want for King Kong's gallstones? <laughs> that face, um, that face was $50,000. It's the largest wall face ever. 
All right, I'll give you 15 for it. I was hoping to get $25. <laughs> <laughs> 15 for the face. And then you see somebody driving that home on a flatbed. Like, <laughs> the enormous <laughs> face sticking out of the flatbed of a truck. <laughs> it looked like the rib on Fred Flintstone's car. He's like, I saw that face. And I had to have it. I was like, I need to put a face on the wall by my zen garden. It feels more zen. That'll go so, so well with my other huge plastic faces. Oh, if he starts naming those rocks, I'm going to be the happiest vlogger in the world. <laughs> I Well, obviously the name for that one is Rose. <laughs> and he's wearing a Versace robe. He's very into robes. After he did his last video with the robe, guess what? He has a robe for sale. It was, for sale. It was product placement because everybody's like, why are you dressed like that? Is this going to be his new pose now? He only, Or do his legs not bend anymore? Like they just bent up. He can't straighten them. He looks like he, looks like he sold the bottom half of his legs for that block. I can't. I needed this laugh so bad. Oh my gosh. He's going to name them. He had the largest amethyst. Now he has the largest quartz. Jeffree Star boasts the best pointless <laughs> <laughs> adornments to his house that yeah. anyone has ever had. I mean, I'm not going to make fun of the robe because if I had that much money, I'd have some I'd have some nice comfy robes in my house. And that's that's a really nice robe. <laughs> it's just weird that he's in the sand with it. It's weird that he's in the sand <laughs> you know, with it. That he's, like, it's weird to me that he only wears robes now. <laughs> you know, he only sits in a zen position like, like he's meditating with his robes. What has happened to Jeffree Star? <laughs> oh, we, well, a lot. A lot has happened. So I think this yeah. is probably a reaction to the drama. He's just like, he's got a big, huge house and money. He's and, just fully lost it. And so, yeah, he's he's becoming more and more eccentric because he's <laughs> making up for some um, bad press and bad, you know, he's just like, I don't. I don't see... This is his way of sticking his fingers in his ears to all of the drama <laughs> surrounding Shane and him and, and everything else that's come out about him. He's just not even going to respond to it anymore. He's just going to buy rocks and <laughs> do weird, eccentric things. This is a new form of acting out, is what it is. It's like, if I can't make you love me, I'm just going to go crazy and and start collecting gemstones. Just, that's it. If... <laughs> I'm just going to make my house look like I'm a borrower. <laughs> I'm going to try gonna... to look like I'm tiny. <laughs> he's going to start next. He's going to be like, right now as we speak, he's got people on the hunt for Jade. He's got people. He's like, I don't care what it is. If it's huge, I'm buying it. <laughs> Can you send some children into some mines? <laughs> I want the biggest Jade. I don't I... care how these people are treated. I need Jade <laughs> I for care. my mood. I don't care how much it costs. I don't care how many people have to die. I want to feel like I'm five inches tall in my own house. <laughs> you know, he sent out, you know, they just sent out a new rover to Mars. That was him. He wants a, he wants a gem from Mars. This is, he's going to sit down. He's going to sit there with his real hair falling out because it's radioactive. Go, this is the largest rock. <laughs> the largest rock from Mars. This is the largest this Mars year. rock. <laughs> it's called Jeffrey Tonium because I discovered it. <laughs> it's in my house. <laughs> charge people to come touch the rose quartz <laughs> and the amethyst amethyst is my birthstone by the way and not once in my life did it ever occur to me that i could maybe own the largest amethyst <laughs> from the uh, unearthed this year somebody was saying <clears throat> i think i saw on twitter somebody said Teresa roma rivals him for a larger uh quartz or amethyst or something really? like that so now they're gonna have gem wars <laughs> they're gonna be surrounded so yeah it's weird I don't, and the pose is always like seething sexy. It's not like, hey, here's me with my hobby, my yeah. stone. <laughs> it's always like, this is the sexiest Zen garden. Yeah. I've been raking all day. It looks. He thinks <laughs> that's raking. <laughs> I've been raking in my Zen garden. I feel so zen This is ex but, eccentricity. You know, that's yeah. what this is. This yeah. is like, um, and it's fun to watch. I it's have to, to admit. Watch. Who it's, is like this on the planet? It's entertaining. Very few people. Yeah. It is entertaining. And, it, um, and, and I hope this isn't a sign of insanity. <laughs> I hope that it just, 
I mean, I think he's embracing that fact that he lives in a house like that. He's like, if I live in a house like this, I have to either do, you know, gun running or something illegal, <laughs> or you get lions to, or tiger, like, and, or gemstones. You either have to collect really weird stuff, or you have to be into something illegal. He's, he's, <laughs> or total, both. Yeah, <laughs> he is so close to getting exotic animals. Like he's going the <laughs> Michael Jackson route, like. I don't know if he has a name for his house yet, you know, but he probably will eventually. He'll have a name. How does he not have a name for it? You know, like, I mean, yeah. like the Ken Kennedy's called it Camelot. Michael Jackson had Neverland. How could you have all of this and not have a name for your empire? <laughs> <clears throat> the mausoleum. <laughs> really big mausoleum. <clears throat> that face is bizarro. I think we've covered everything about this I think, picture. I mean, yeah. how could you talk? We talked for 10 minutes about this picture almost. It's, a, it's, it's worth a thousand words at least. What else were you saying that wig looked like? Like he? Oh, there's a lot of things. It looks like Natalie Portman from Leon the Professional. <laughs> it looks... <laughs> Why is he straddling it too? It I mean... looks like he's got elephantitis of the nuts. <laughs> <laughs> like, what, what is he doing? The Why photo... is he acting like this is the sexiest gemstone ever? This photo shoot does look a little bit like he's... Like he's about to have sex with that rock. <laughs> <laughs> it is so strange. Yeah. I love my gemstones. He probably like, I don't know, puts them around his bed or something. Around, like, I guess that's his new thing. Yeah, I guess it's his new thing. I mean, I'm sort of rooting for him in a little, in a, in a sort of, in a weird way, you know? Yeah. He's, he's living his best Alice in Wonderland life. <laughs> but seriously, what do you think the chances are that he's making sure these things are harvested ethically? Oh, zero percent. <laughs> he doesn't care. He's just buying them somewhere. You Is there like a, a gemstone? But he's not getting that on eBay. No, yeah. There's no, there's no <laughs> Amazon for that it's kind of Amazon stuff. Amazon Prime. <laughs> the large, typing it into Amazon. Largest ass quartz. <laughs> Largest, bizarre. Yeah. I want to see what's next. Is he going to get every month? Yeah, and then then I mean, next, next year he'll trade this in for a bigger quartz. Yeah, no. I mean, I mean, five years from now he's going to be playing croquet with flamingos. <laughs> <laughs> he's he's going to have a quartz war, quartz wars with <laughs> Teresa Romer. You they're going to get a bigger one and a bigger one. It's going to become a Pixar like he's gonna, short. He's going to have a he's going to have a rose quartz shaped robe. No, he's going to have a, a you know what I'm trying to say. He's going to have a robe made out of quartz. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's getting a little weird. He's gonna, you know what he's gonna do? He's gonna take one room of his house and just build a pyramid. <laughs> it's gonna be so so crazy. His house is gonna become like a seventh wonder type of thing. Like he just, he's got a coffee maker that looks like the head of the Sphinx. <laughs> it is Egyptian phase. They will be talking about this for hundreds of years, but we're alive to see it now. We are so lucky. That's all they're going to ask in the future is, what was it like being alive with Jeffree Star? <laughs> like, it was trippy. Those were trippy times. Yeah, like how, yeah. Mm -hmm. I sort of wonder what, would it, what it must be like living living at the same time period as Marie, Marie Antoinette, and I don't need to wonder. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much for listening, you guys. <clears throat> I'm coughing because I was laughing so hard. This was just fun. Many thanks to Jeffrey. Keep them coming, Jeffrey. We got nothing else to look forward to. Yeah. Until next time, House Row out.